my name is Jesha Loy. I'm the Director of Branding and Market Development for Yakun International. And because Yakun is my grandfather, that makes me the third generation family business owner. What was my first experience with the family business? Um, my, first, my first experience was actually eating. So I was only about six or seven years old when I uh, uh, visited the, the La Pasa shop and it was still very, uh, very makeshift, uh, very traditional. And so uh, that was where I, I, I would sit down to eat. Um, and my uncle and my auntie would be working there. What was my favorite snack as a child? Um, it would definitely still be the kaya toast, uh, but my uncle actually liked to push the kaya toast crackers to me. So it's it's uh, those saltine crackers with uh, kaya and butter. So he, he thinks that that's what I liked, and I actually did like that a lot with just a cup of hot Milo. So that would be my favorite and earliest memory of um, Yakun actually, what they served. Um, I don't actually remember the price because I always had it for free, but I cannot even imagine it being more than like 40 cents. What do you remember most from your growing up years? Um, so I mean, I grew up in the 80s to 90s, so I think Singapore was still pretty traditional. Um, technology had not kicked in, the buses were still not aircon, you know, we didn't have phones going to school. I do uh, enjoy a lot of just being uh, back to basics, using pen and paper, um, pencils, um, using your memory to remember things, using the roadmap. Uh, so these are some of my fondest memories of uh, growing up. What were some of my hobbies? My hobbies growing up, mm, like any boy, you know, playing soccer with my friends uh, um, in a basketball court. So everything was inappropriate. The ball was old. The basketball court was repurposed to be a soccer soccer pitch. Um, so that was one of my fondest memories. What do I miss most about the past? I think for me personally, I with the, with with much use of technology these days, I actually do miss memorizing you know critical phone numbers, the phone numbers of my best friends. I even find myself um, not being so familiar with roads nowadays when I drive and I have to refer to the map but you know I, I, I watch my dad and I see how he can memorize street names and, and directions so I find that our um, ability to remember things may have been uh, diminished a little bit with the use of technology and maybe that's something that I do miss uh, a bit about the past.